All right, today we're going to play with provisioning a little bit to understand how that works. So I'm in my company's instance of success factors, and you can see I do not have calibration added. How do I do that? Well, uh, you do have to buy the licensing for that. But what happens is success factors or one of success factors partner will go on the back end into provisioning. When provisioning, you can select the company instance and then go into settings based on that company's instance. So you can see we have all these different properties um, that are specific to that company's instance. So let's say we wanted to enable uh, calibration. We can go into that setting within um, provisioning. Let's see if I can find that here. Let's go leave one above it. There, enable calibration. Um, let's give that a try. So we'll go back up the provisioning and click save feature. That is saved. Now we'll go back here and we'll try a refresh. Go back to admin tools. Calibration still not enabled. So what you typically have to do is log out and log back in a couple of times. So I'll go back to my log and next year at the company page. And we're going to go back to admin tools. And we can see calibration is now enabled. So things like that, some of the most advanced settings are all done in the provisioning uh, part of it. So admin still have a lot of uh, functionality. But uh, if there's something that you'd like to be done, you just can't find the setting, uh, you should definitely check in with your SuccessFactors partner to see if it's something that they can do on the back end for you. All right, thanks for watching. Again, my name is Brandon Webb, and uh, hopefully this helped in some way, shape, or form.